Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Cards with Wirefly. What I got for you guys today is a little section that's not really called anything. I mean, I want to call it what happened in tech. So what we're going to talk about is what happened in tech, but cell phone related since we are Wirefly and we are a cell phone based company. So let's get right into it. I may mention some things that I already mentioned in past videos, but I just want to touch them, like I said, of things that happened this week. And first off, I want to start by the date, September 3rd. Mark your calendars with September 3rd because that's when Sony is going to revamp their Xperia line. So if you're a big fan of the Sony Xperia phones, stay tuned for September 3rd. And also September 3rd, like I mentioned in my other video, is when Samsung is going to announce their Note 3. So like I said, if you're excited for or like that series of phones, be sure to look out for those phones September 3rd. Also in September, but six days after that, September 9th, is when Apple is supposedly going to announce the iPhone 6. I already mentioned the rumors and all the specs and all the good stuff that's going to supposedly be in that phone. So if you guys want to check that video out, I'll leave that video down in the description so you guys can see the rumors that are going around on the iPhone 6. And like I said, that's going to happen September 9th. And another thing that we got, not a precise date, but we got sort of an estimate of when it's going to come out is the iWatch. Unfortunately, it's not going to come out with the iPhone 6. It's going to come out supposedly towards December. So if you thought you were going to get an iPhone with an iWatch, you are most likely going to have to wait to December. Or at least that's what sources are saying. We're not really sure. Like I said, that's more of a rumor. But I just want to mention in here because a lot of people are excited for the iWatch. Another thing that was rumored and it's soon to come is the LG G3B. That's a phone that's going to compete with the Note 4 and the Note series in general. It's pretty much the LG G3's bigger brother. It's going to come with the stylus. So like I said, it's going to compete with that phone or that specific phone area, which is like the phablet area of phones. So if you're not a big fan of the Note series, you're going to have another option out there with the LG G3 Beat. And I know a lot of other things happen, but I just want to mention one more thing that happened this week that I thought was major. Apparently, BlackBerry is going through a transformation and they're starting to gather some people. So if you're looking for a job, be sure to hit up BlackBerry. But anyways, those were the things that I thought were major in this week. And I'm pretty sure there were a lot more things in the smartphone world. But like I said, I just wanted to mention the main ones or what I thought were the main points this week. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys like this section, if I should keep doing it every Friday, like a recap of the things I thought were important this week in the cell phone world. But anyways, that was my recap of this week's what happened in tech. And like I said, this is not the official name. If you guys like that name, leave a suggestion down below. But anyways, I was Carlos Wirefly and I will see you guys in the next video.